Hello everyone, Xenism here. Welcome back to Let's Play Blaster Master Zero Two. Last time. Last time, we found out why leanness is such a mean guy. Oh my god. And we've got Andrea. Oh my god! I hate this. I hate this. Andrea only has two more pips, so we shouldn't be looking far. Here search. <sighs> okay, so I'm going to no, I'll come back to there. Right here, I should put the pinpoint with locations. The signal. Jason is near G Sophia. You can check the location on the map. Only a bit longer, Jason. And there is technically one more dungeon. One more indoor dungeon. So I can just go back there. Which is not that hard to do. So I'll just. Now, I did not mean to do that, I meant to do Warbind.
And our final upgrade. So let's return. And then go we'll save Jason. Because we know something's definitely happened. Because we wouldn't be playing as Eve, even even if Eve doesn't know it. Because really characters don't know they're in a video game. See how powerful this is. Yeah, I didn't need to move. Giant mutant. He's been turned to stone. Did the mutant do, do this? Jesus' vital signs are weak, but they're still there. He's still alive. Thank goodness. That must be what Elfie told us about. The mutant cocoon. His energy reading is unbelievably terrifying. This thing must, have, must be collecting energy from the entire dimensional space. The mutant overlord, Plenty G, if the mutant fought so far, do we exist just to send energy here? Every part of this is a system. That must be why they began their invasion. The invasion that will destroy all dimensional space. Jason must have tried to fight. He tried to protect the universe all by himself. Jason, I'll fight too. I'll defeat that thing. I will save you. Warning, the mutant cocoon. Droll revel. I need to know this because I need to immediately go into. Okay. And. Oh, you. Assholes. I can't hit higher than that. Leave that to us. Receiver? Is that Gombe? <laughs> He's not alone, young lady. Flower! Hi, every. Naturally, we support droids that are present as well. Um, long to no see, Eve. We're coming to save ya. But how? 
Some guy named Leibniz called us up and told us everything. He told us how to use the markers, or how the markers worked, and that you were in danger. So yeah, like, we're both, right? We can totally use those. And go straight there, like, BAM! You just, you just gotta hang in there until we can get there. You hear? Thank you so much. It wasn't all for nothing after all. People we met, time we spent with them. This is the result of our journey, no matter what. I won't give up. Everyone is on their own. I'll do what I can until we can meet in core. Meet in cocoon. Until we get here. Just in time, didn't we? <laughs> so good to see you, Eevee Weevee. Now's not the time for catching up. We've gotta protect the young one, Eevee. Roger. Yeah, I'm getting totally serious. I'm gonna show you what I'm made of. Thank you, everyone. Alright, everyone, I need your help. Now's our only chance to defeat it. Excel Blast! Override lock! I'm so sorry, Alfie. This might destroy Andrea. Don't worry, Eve. Andrea and I will surely live on in your hearts. Thank you, Alfie. Leave this to me. I'll take this purification engine, cheat welding inside my body, and pour it all into Andrea. It take this. Acceleration blast. Energy. I have the XL Blast. Thank you, Eve. Must appear you for your law. Jason. Sure did. Jeez, I can't believe you. <laughs> Sorry, Eve. I'll make up to you. Another time. But for now, it seems our fight isn't over yet. Huh? Ooh. You damned mutant core. Cocoon. So this is your true form. Let's finish this. I couldn't do it alone. I couldn't do it before. But now, I'm not alone. But my side, and in my heart, Eve is here. And my comrades. Let's go. Gaia Sophia. Warning. The Invem X. Draw level. Master.
yeah, that's... <laughs> that happens, and... <laughs> I was trying to let you listen to the music, because, oh, that is one of my favourite tracks in this game. <sighs> but Drevel Master is crazy. He's... the best way to describe him is... A com it's, it's basically fighting... A combination of every... MA in this game. He's got a drain bar. He's got close range prowess, drilling prowess as air. He has the energy lasers like weakness. He's got the powerful blasts like uh Adam. The only one he doesn't really have is, weirdly enough, uh, Kabigo. Which even then, you can say that's represented by the green. God! <laughs> he how hard this boss fight gets! Like, it's fun, but God! You know what? Oh, I know I should do them. Oh, maybe I'm... No, I don't want to talk to Eve. Shutting up for this. I didn't know that one shot him. I just... I only did that because I was like, this is going to do massive damage. I've never tried it, but it's probably going to do. I didn't think it one shot him. <laughs> oh, I'm, I... Oh my god. <sighs> We've successfully exited interdimensional space. Huh, is that... Planet Sophia. We finally made it. So this is your home planet, Eve. Through we thank everyone for fighting by our side. We made it our way back to regular space to see our journey through. Gombe, Stein, Kana, and all the support droids. Thank you. Before we knew it, our destination was right before our eyes. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit better. I'm feeling better already. That's right. Where was due to changes Eve experienced in interdimensional space, perhaps the powerful Excel Blast she unleashed that cleansed my purification. Whatever the reason, the immune infection in Eve's body is gone. If you started his journey in order to save Eve, 
the end, we achieved our goal before even reaching our destination. Our journey was one expected thing after another, but the most unexpected development of all happened right then. Oh, I'm sure it's no coincidence. We never gave up. We faced every challenge we met. I believe this is the result of everything we went through. Eve. Our battles, the mutants, and all the friends we met. If we were missing even one thing, I wouldn't be here right now. I wouldn't be here together with you, Jason. By the way, Jason, I... I have something I want to tell you. And that is the end of Blaster Master 02's story. There is still one more episode. So, I might as well get my thoughts on my project. I'll be real. <laughs> I had a lot of fun. Though, this might be one of the most semi boring last place because I won't lie. Compared to 1 and 3, I don't have much to talk about with this game. Because I like 3, so there's a lot I want to talk about or just come along to. This game. Well, I was surprised that the final boss could be one shot. I, I didn't think anything huge about this, because the guy Sophia's system gets reworked and free and it works so much better. But, uh, but then again, free is also just so much more fun. But yeah. At least doing this, at least means the next last play, while Fire Emblem is going on, is definitely going to be Blaster Master 3. So, because there is post credits. So, I guess, once we're done, done. Actually, I can probably talk about Before people ask, there isn't any, um, what should I put it? Post. There isn't any extra mode, which is sounding. I kind of wish we could play as the other enemies. Like, I find it interesting if, how we t tackle some of the bosses as in Drake. Granted, it would just be freezing them and blasting them, but hey. The only extra we do have is that there's one game mode, because I'm not playing Empress. But the other one actually does have importance. We'll find out later in another LP. Thank you for playing. But, got post gate, post cutscene credits. This is Earth. Jason Frenick, please respond. The mutants have attacked. We need your support. G Sophia, please respond. Beat. This is Earth. Unbelievable. What a hilarious situation. <laughs> we haven't noticed at all. This home is in trouble. Earth. Planet but be one saved. <laughs> I wonder how you feel when I'm the big hero this time around. I hope it drives him crazy. Let's go. With that, this is Zeno and Zimmer signing out because this is where we're going next time. This is a very short episode, Jesus. And actually, because of how short it is, you know what? Screw it. 
let's continue. I was going to end this ep episode, but I might as well. Let's go into extra game. Now, most extra games have... No, there's two extra games. Copen and Empress. Empress has an Autrum version of G Sophia. Copen has Gigolo Lola from from X1, which is hilarious. But Copen handles bosses differently because he's there's no way to do it. He's OP. Even Planade G. I don't trigger! Oh wait, that side. I know this. Idle trigger. Sorry, I really love this. You can tell. Yeah, all these weapons are from X1, so. And we are also pretty much invincible. things gameplay wise because we could well we can't just go straight to the boss because I think the boss area the final boss area is actually locked for each character technically every character Empress and Coven both start here but they can't actually access it because until they get back their tank well the tank in Eve they're taking Eve and Empress in this case. Copen's unique. I believe in no matter what route, what game mode you choose, you get to find the broken blast round. You can ignore it, but you know what? Because I want to show you how absurd Copen is. I'm going to give you the extra boss fight. Capel. First. <laughs> Have you realized how not a threat the bosses are? Because you're going to see this isn't just like a side problem. Uh, this is a thing for every thing. He's also very much invincible. The only problem with this mode is literally just not really having a way to recharge bullets. We 
just go charge up through. It's unique that they gave each character actual an actual uniqueness gameplay wise. to show you the joke that is Dig Roller. Dimensional Glutton, Dig Roller. It's music kids actually. Yep, it's music kids. Power. It's a joke. Of course, we're still gonna pick up the blast rifle. Weapon made from unfamiliar technology appears to be broken and inoperable. Nice touch. Nice touch in changing dialogue. We don't need to really care about much else. Yeah, Copen doesn't have anything to worry about. But for Copen, if we just get a new, a new weapon, Iker Hunter, and, if, and we can't even get in, it's just here. Iker Hunter is just really good though. Because it's basically just Andrea's ability. Especially since bullet dashing is so much easier to do than anything else. And since we can just face through everything, there's not really anything that bosses can do. It shows that when you're playing as any other character, <laughs> This game kind of isn't that hard. It's kind of boring. The only thing G Lola Giga Lola is needed is literally to traverse places. Because even here, I'm just going right back to. Uh, Going right back to what I used to use. So, yeah. Kinda how not a threat bosses are. Hell, if you just if you if you just care about power tripping, just get the cool DLC with Blast Master 2. Because seriously, you don't need to do anything after that. You just get the weapons and then not care. <laughs> like I said, a joke. I go her. Let 
this, fight the final boss. And there is no Jason, which is a nice added touch. The Mutant Cocoon. Joke Raffle. Yeah, I'm not even going to give it, say its proper name. This guy's a joke. It's this. It's just boring. Come on. Also, yeah, Koma can jump as high as a tank, which is hilarious. Apparently we can just stand in between. And now, we're into the final boss. Warning, the Invent X. Draw level, master. And this is an actual threatening fight. Is what I would say. If we didn't have Ico Hunter, Ico Hunter still damages, damages him. Yeah, not to crazy extent, but it's also a case. All right, we also have Idle Trigger. Forgot to point out. We can just make this an absolute joke. We're going to bring it down. I'm not going to care about. What happens to me because it is but a joke It's a joke A joke. I have a hard time? Just place coping. And we get a slightly different ending credits because Copen doesn't need Gigalola. <laughs> I'll let it play to that, though, because there is a different end screen. But with that, I don't really have anything else to say. I had fun playing Co Copen's bit. It was just oh, dash, 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 blast, 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 blast. I'm basically playing Luminous Avenger X. Uh, but, yeah, next time, I'll contain Fire Emblem, Free Houses, and next time on Blaster Master, we'll be switching to Blaster Master Free and find out what happens. Clearly something happens, because we wouldn't have a fair game if there wasn't about a bit of conflict. 
This is Ian and Zimmer, signing out.